Warning, just in case if you have seizures due to flashing lights and you are not tolerant with flashing lights or moving lights and all that stuff, I suggest not watching this video. That is a strong disclaimer because there will be flashing lights and moving lights. Just letting you know, please enjoy the video. What is up guys, Batman the Gamer here and I'm here for two unboxings. We're going to do separates but we're going to make both videos. So this is the keyboard, I'm going to go ahead and unbox it and set it up and give a review on it like I always do. And here is the new one. This is an add-on mouse. What Ailey? Oh I know. Add on to this and it helps to adjust it. But I have no sense of that really. For the adjustment part, it literally just snaps on there like that. I might keep it like that. That actually looks pretty cool. Looks, does it feel nice? Uh huh. It kind of feels nice. Instructions. We figured it out and everything. Well, I didn't figure it out. I didn't read Jack Diddley squat. The cameraman did. You go to page 16. 16 and 17, is it? Yeah, 16 and 17. It'll, it'll tell you what to do. Then there's brightness level up here, so you can have it off, dim, medium, bright, and off. I like it on bright because why not? And then, uh, you know, standard. I'm going to show you FN is function. You got one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Seven is none. Eight, nine, ten. Zero, that's zero. Ten is just medium cyanide. And you can switch your color change with one, two, and three. You can switch your color change. And you can do it randoms, whatever you want. Uh, FN equal will always take you back to that. Increase the speed. You go up. Okay. You can go down to decrease and everything. Which way you want it to go? I want it to say if I want it to go that way, it's gonna spin that way. Let's bring up the speed. It's gonna go that way. If you want it to go that way, it's gonna go that way. You get to choose which way you want to go. Then to turn it off in general, just FN7 and it's off. And G1, G2, and all that stuff, that will change different settings too and everything. Just basic what I just did one through and F through. Same difference. So thanks for watching, guys. That was the keyboard, and uh, the keyboard mat is pretty legit. It helps you if you're like an on the top person, but in like a dress door drawer, like how I'm doing it, it's, it's it feels very nice for gaming. But overall, like just in general, like if you're just using it as like a gaming you console game, but you edit and all that stuff like this, I suggest without the base play because that's how I am. But that's, that's all I got for this. Please like, share, and subscribe, and I will see you all in the second unboxing for the mouse.